Friends, today is Saturday, October 8. We're going to look at a final characteristic from Psalm 23 of a great guide, a great shepherd. And it's a, a man or woman who is someone, this last characteristic, someone who has a deep hope. Listen to uh, Psalm 23, verse 6. Surely, I am certain, goodness and mercy shall follow me. When was the last time you followed someone? Or somebody followed you? Shall follow me all the days of my life. And then I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. But in a, in a whole nother unending life, my whole life long. So um, it's an art, isn't it, to be hopeful, to cultivate hope, and then to be able to convey that to other people without becoming um, what my mom used to call Pollyanna. So Pollyanna was someone who was good at ignoring life's dark side, Valley of the Shadow, tragic events and just uh, concentrating on the positive things. And so by shutting out the negative things, they were able to maintain an artificial optimism. And um, that's not what the psalmist is recommending. Remember the psalmist said, I, I might, uh, that party that, 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 that the Lord wants to throw for me might be in the presence of my enemies, it might be in the preparation for a battle. Ooh, it might be in the valley of the shadow that I am uh, expected to find my peace and security because there are these darker, harder realities to life. So this is no Pollyanna perspective. Um, it's not a always look on the bright side of life. Ba -ba -dum -bum -bum -ba -dum -bum. No, this is realism, but it's also got a triumphant hope. Uh, surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. One of the ways to become hopeful and to practice, practice hopefulness is to look back at the previous days of your life and see what's been following you. See how is it that God has ordered your life to bring uh, out the possibilities and the opportunities of this present moment. How has God made you you? Uh, how, what signs of grace have you seen in the story of your own life?